Hello everyone, welcome to the coin toss. Spectacular game of volleyball ahead of us here. In Torino and the Palo Alto Tour. Both these teams have the best record in the tournament. Vegas is one thing. Actually, we'll be coming to that as a cover. There's Russia that game. It's a great cross. Vegas at the start of this tournament. And we've got a day. At the third round. It's a sellout here in Turin for this one. And oh, I didn't want to tell you, but look away, too late. This all Serbia already happened. Poland, USA about to happen. Before we get to the game, though, it's time for the national anthems, and we'll start with Poland and finish with the USA. First, the national anthem of Poland. Siamo con l'inno nazionale della Polonia.
between tonight's international referee. La presentazione degli arbitri internazionali di questo incontro. The first referee from Serbia, Vladimir the lights are going to go out. The stars are coming out to play. Seeing the stars coming out onto court. And now, let's meet the teams. First, the starting lineup for Poland. Ed ora la presentazione delle squadre iniziamo dalla Poland. It will be. He'll come out onto court first. Firstly, number one. Piotr Nowakowski going through the middle. Number six, Bartosz Kurek will be in the opposite slot. It's Arte Schausput, number seven, through the outside. Fabian Zuska, number 11, setting. Michael Kubiak, number 13, the captain through the outside. Mateusz Spieniak, number 20, middle blocking. Pavel Zadorski, number 17, the starting group. This is how they line up. The head coach for Poland is Vita Heinen. Vita Heinen. He's a man with a plan. This is plan. See him going past this team, though. USA getting ready to come out into court. Number one, Matthew Anderson is in the opposite slot. Number two, Aaron Russell is going through the outside. Number three, and captain, Taylor Sander, through the outside. Number 11, Michael Christensen getting a slap. He's going to be setting. Number 12, Maxwell Holt is going through the middle. Number 20, David Smith, is going through the middle. The starting Libero, number 22, Eric Shoji. Without question, as we see how uh, the USA lineup, both teams putting out their strongest team. John Spore undefeated until the third round when it didn't matter and he put out the second team against Brazil. This game matters. Two teams playing for a guaranteed medal. As to the colour, who knows? As to whether they get there or not, we're going to find out. The crowd can't wait. The players are just having to wait. But not any longer. It's Poland in the white and red serving the USA in all blue receiving its semi-final action from the men's FIVB World Championship here in Italy. It's been co-hosted in Bulgaria. All the action now centered in Torino. USA get their side out. Maybe Anderson to go back to the serving. Kubiak, there'll be a lot of brilliance from him. He's a man on a mission. For those of you who have been wondering where he's been, he was left in the wilderness by Antigua in 2014. He's back at the bank here in 2018. That's a good touch. Poland have it into transition. But Kurek doesn't find a way through this time. Neither does Shalput. Good up by Shoji. Russell block out. USA get their side out. Trentino player, 
big favourite here in Italy. Certainly with the fans. Oh, that's a massive block from Holt, who's going to be playing his trade in Medina this season. Along with Michael Christensen, plenty of a real Italian flavour to this USA team. Here in Italy, lovely block by Holt. Speed attack, that's a brilliant pick up by Anderson. Good up by Zatorski. Kubiak can only volley it. There's a real chance here now for the US. One on one, and a block out. USA, four one up. Lovely quick ball. No chance for the middles to go out of the middle, but it's sadly just makes the his best mate. Very nice ball in by Kubiak to allow options for Poland inside. Unable to deliver anything meaningful though this time. There's a touch, there is a touch, Smith trying to hide in the crowd and not be spotted, but it already was spotted. That one to Zuzka. And Kubiak just waits, looks for the gap. And he's able to put the ball on the floor. You're so cool. A time out. back on level terms. Block <laughs> a 
Kick out by Kubiak. Sanders overcooked that one. He tried to go to the line and tried to miss the block. And he's missed the line in the process. So we head into the technical timeout. And it's part of you have the lead. Teams played each other in the Volleyball Nations League prior to this tournament. USA beat Poland twice, 3 0, and in the final round in Leo, they beat them 28 26, 25 17, 25 18. That was then, this is now, and it's Poland who have a two point lead. Make that one. Kubiak not going to risk injury. against the USA, Smith it was. And the ball was wrapped right into him by Kurek. Popped it very hard, just an excellent set. One on one, might have fancied Russell to put it away, but Kurek took an extreme cross court angle away from Russell. start this for the USA with the unforced errors. We're going to just check it though. See whether or not Russell caught some of the line. Other players will be playing in Italy for a Taiwan Excellence Latina. Oh. It is an unforced error. Poland have the point. That's an ace serve from Kubiak. It looked to be an innocuous enough serve, but it was the position of it, the placement of it, that did all the damage. And it was Rushku, in fact, who hit the serve, not Kubiak. That's miles in as well. Not 
time out called by the USA. Lot of volleyball left. Lot of volleyball. Hey, they've gotten on teams like this before. Teams haven't responded very well. So let's let's side out here. Okay. Put it back on them and see how they respond. Okay. Here we go. USA. Trishka once again with his served little roll shot, but that's easily dealt with by Shoji. But it's even more so magnificently dealt with by Poland, who were just waiting for the pipe. Kurek just stepped in and shut it down with the help of Bieniek, who travelled across the A quick and into the pipe. And a block for Poland, and they are now cruising in this first set. 14-7. Trzyszka <laughs> makes the dig to Torski. A decent ball up. There's a chance now. Yeah. Russell gets the block out. Kubiak could get, make the most of his opportunity. And at last, the USA get off with that very tricky rotation. for that one, correct, continuation attack. And that first error by Kurek. USA will take that point and edge a little bit closer. It's an ace serve. Fantastic. Shuska was trying to see if he could kick that one back through. Didn't quite work. Back to the serving line again, looking to bring some heat to this party. Again, USA, another point. We've certainly got Poland scrambling, but somehow Schalke gets that through the block. Serving a 
blocking has been outstanding here in the finals. 16-10 up, we head into the second technical timeout. That's a really good pass, though, from Sander. But Russell hasn't found any hands. This is not what I think anybody was expecting here. Perhaps the Polish fans were. Poland is dominating this set. Oh, lovely. Kubiak with the dolly dropper, but it wasn't read by the USA. This is what Poland do so well, they mix it up. Power, spin, smart volleyball. Anderson with a good pass. Bieniek just commits in the middle. It's as if Poland know what the USA are gonna do before the USA do. Excellent block by Bieniek. John Spurl said in the second time, and there's still plenty of volleyball left in this one. Nothing to be panicking about just yet. Just say need to overcome any nerves or frustration they may be feeling, just relax, settle in, and get ready for a big game. That helps, good serve by Anderson. And a great block by Russell. Play by Pilot, but Schalpert misses down the line. That one's not going to make it over. USA doing some good work trying to make some inroads into this lead that Poland have. Another side out. Russell. 
opponent come again. Correct. Good stop by Holt, but it was just too far away from Shoji. They managed to slow Correct down, but the ball still hit the floor. Holt still continuing out to his left, couldn't stop to get that ball. Correct will serve. Missed his first one at the first time with this rotation. What's he got now? So that come. Although that one did travel further. 21 is the key point in volleyball. It's part of the stats that comes out. The team that gets to 21 first when it goes to 25 only, 90 odd percent of the time win the set. So it's not looking great for the USA at the moment, unless they can get this one beyond 24 points each. And it's not looking like that's going to happen either, right, is it? Current. Shelpuk. Good leave by the USA. Good up. I don't get two blockers, but it's not enough for them. Jushka is used by Sander. Poland's two away from taking the opening set. One on one, it's going to be difficult to stop Kurek. play from Anderson, he's got that down in front of Kubiak. Christensen was doing the 100 metre sprint, got there in time, Anderson then doing all the good hitters do, using the block to his advantage. A serve from Sander, the USA not giving up and not giving in. Poland call the timeout. from him that has just a scrambling. And Kubiak tries to roll that one to position four. He didn't get his angles right. USA now back to it in three. Both coaches have used their timeouts. Latorski. Keeps the ball off the floor. 
Oh, that's an incredible pickup. No double touch on the first contact over the net, and Kurek finds a way through the block. Poland now have set point. This is an incredible pickup. That's brilliant from Sander. And this is exceptionally good. Kurek, we found the only gap available. Kanaski's come in to block for Poland. Just good, will serve. Side out save, Smith on the seat quick. Poland, three chances to take the set now from side out themselves. Missed, but he thinks he hasn't, so they're going to challenge. Kubiak thinks he's snotted this one into the line. And Poland have a set. How much did it compress? Not enough. And Christensen said, oh yeah, it was just, just fractionally out. He was right. Must have left an impression in the floor. Two set points saved then for the USA. They need to save two more to make this set interesting. Smith won't mind any of that. It's a good serve, but good up by Satorski. That's gone out. No, it's come off the block. And Poland take the set 25 22. USA, though, gets some momentum to take into the next one. Off and hold speakers.
five blocks, six aces. And they're the spectacular bricks. And there were plenty of them. 25-22. And Poland gave the USA nine points. No changes for the USA for the second set. No changes for Poland either. Christensen with the serve. USA 1 0 down so far. In his best of five sets in counter. Has to come back on the extreme angle. Smith waiting for it. Sander off the block and first break point for the USA. Russell with some good covering. Oh, what a spike by Kurek. That was frighteningly good. No chance at all for Anderson. There's certainly no chance for Russell. Lovely, but it's going to be, oh, it is Poland who are going to be penalised for reaching across as Christensen went to make that set. That was because he fooled them into thinking he was going to be going and playing the ball over the net. Kurek played it. Gets his swagger on with that one. Big ace for the USA. The chase by Russell.
going to take that point. So let's see who have the lead. Good hustle from Russell. Ski because it means Kurek is set free on the right hand side. in the back row couldn't go up and block this one had to get out of the way of it Pressure on Poland. Should be getting better from here yet. Get across. Get it better across the net. Send it back. serves then Kurek that's a brilliant good swing for him so far so far in this match Kurek seems to have the better of the two opposites between the battle between him and Anderson it only seems that way because they both lost two in points one in the first set two technical time at USA lead by two Playing the odds here. The basis of the fact they probably believe that this level is unsustainable for Poland. Certainly, that first set was exceptional. The USA seem to have a bit of a grip on this game now. In the second set, they lead by two. They're beginning to get their middles working. They're beginning to put some pressure on from serve. Because when they don't, that's what's going to happen. Poland have 
leveled up. Say we prepared, but they know that Poland's serving is tough. And the outside hitters are going to have to deal with angle system situations where not all options are available, so that means they're going against two, maybe three blockers, as Sandra did. facet of both teams play here is that the setters like to get that ball out quickly to the wing hitters to make it so difficult for the middles to come and help out in the block and when they do get touches it ends up being like that. out by Zatorski. Good cover by Poland. No carry has been called against them, so play continues. Anderson. Oh, you, no! Oh, no! That looked like he got that in. It's been given as out. It should have been, oh, yes, oh, yes. They are going to challenge it. Maybe it will be, oh, yes. Such a good swing because he, he came in to the court and then it meant that the block went with him and there was all that line to go at. But he did have to hit away from his body to try and find it. Did he hit too far away? No, he didn't! It is! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! As the USA take the points and it's 11-9 now and not 10-10. Sander. Poland call the timeout. Kurek emphatically blocked. Sander watching that one. Smith joining him. Coach is celebrating and quite rightly. You know that's what Excellent. Yeah, the balls are played a rally. I see the controversy. Nice ball, nice ball. Nice ball, nice ball. See if you can do the ball. Come on, come on. Christian with the serve. Christian sitting with the serve. Koski does very well to get past the block.
USA recycle it. Russell is dug. Kubiak's made the error. Find the fingers he was looking for. It's brought back by Kubiak. Shalpuk suddenly, somehow, finds a way through. He's had hardly anything to do in this set with Shalpuk. And then he gets the most difficult one to deal with. There you go, son. Do something with that. Will that do, guys? Yes, it certainly will. Shuts him down. Excellent ball in. Oh, that was a chance somehow. Sander missed it as Smith came across in front of him. May have well have put him off. to the technical timeout with that swing from Anderson giving Poland a two-point lead they turned it around
Anderson. Zhushka not ready for it. Shalpuk does well, but it's free ball here for the USA. Anderson with a free swing, and as good as Shalpuk didn't really know where to go, and now the USA are back level again in this topsy-turvy second set. But neither team's been able to get full control of great swing from Anderson. But even so, Poland was still able to get two blockers out wide. Trying to put some heat back on to what the USA were doing. Without success though. Battered off the block. Sander battles that batters that one through the block as the USA battle to take the point and go in front. Good ball back in by Shoji, hammered away by Holt. USA open up the two-point lead. It was 
wanted a challenge in the middle of that rally. But the button wasn't pressed, no challenge coming. Because of that massive dead touch by Holt. Well, he's got away with that one. And then, USA make the block. It's another point. And it's a four-touch call against Poland. Because it went in the net. There's no interference under the net. So they can challenge the touches, but it wasn't any still. It was a four-touch was the call. Kubiak certainly wasn't, uh, he wasn't under that butt. I say he wasn't under that, he wasn't under that so much. Oh, hello. Well, apologies for that if you understood what he was saying, because I did. Well, that looks like it's touched the block. So it's not four touches, so we'll have a left. But there could well be a tr some trouble here for Poland, and there's going to be some trouble here for Poland, surely. So now there's a challenge from the USA. Well, I just thought for a second there that uh, the referee was going to call the players over and have a little chat with Poland. But what there is a challenge now will be a centre-line violation by Kubiak. I guess the other thing as well is if he's come under the net, but he hasn't made a centre-line violation so much as he's, the whole of his foot hasn't gone over the whole of the line and it's flat on the floor. Has he impeded any of the USA players? So this is where he lands and he comes through. That's not a fault. And now here comes the yellow car for Kubiak, quite rightly, for his uh, altercation through the net to Sander. I'm pretty sure the ref didn't hear what he said, which is just as well, otherwise it would have been more than a yellow getting tasty, isn't it? So we got through the two challenges. But it won't be... It shouldn't be the USA's ball, it should be Poland's ball. It was. There was no fault. It will... I uh, say that because Russell's come back to the serving line, so I'm not sure why they think it would be the USA's ball. Oh, because it was a let. There we go. Sorry for those of you screaming at the TV that it's a let. You're quite right. It's a let play. And it was the USA that was serving. So much going on. I think it was a World Championship semi-final. USA in a good position. Leading Poland, 21-17. Second set, currently one set down in the match. Russell. Very nice swing through the middle. By the youngster, Jakub Kochanowski. He was lightning fast with that one. McDonald's come in, Daniel McDonald, who played through the outside. Third, last third round match for the USA. And the 
Robinson went the right way. He couldn't direct it to any one of his teammates. Let's play that by Kubiak. got up quickly, got out, was available, and then abused the block. That's superb hitting from Sander. Good art by Russell. Sander with a chance to take... Se to set point, and he's done it! Right wing right, that one cross court, it's set point USA. Good up by Russell, high and wide for Sander. And he hits it hard and handsome cross court. Chap the red. Too sure what that's about. It's a little bit of time delay, really, because Poland don't have any timeouts left. Christensen. Brilliant position for the USA here. Plenty of opportunities to side it out. Schultz is in to serve. Also in Schwiefke, number 14, in the back row. Poland. It's been too little too late here. Too late, Sander off the block and it all happens through the net for Poland, but they don't care, they take the set 25 20. It's one all here in Torino. Brilliant swing. What a game! What a game! One all, all to play for. All the highlights from the set.
per lui faccio, faccio, faccio lo faccino no, è un cuore è un cuore lui no, 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 basta, basta voi invece sì, eh ecco bene, bravi, bravi voi sì, subito, veloce ehi, kiss Leap. A little bit of a wall jump from him as he skipped across the court, trying not to land on it. The ball was down already. It was okay. Catch breath, no, no, no. McDonald with an ace serve into this game with a bang. We'll do it again. to celebrate that one as they put Russell down. Like a better area. Excellent block. Oh, yes. Brilliant. When these guys get up and there's no one in front of them, it is impossible to stop them. Uh, USA and Poland playing some magnificent volleyball. Both these teams playing at the highest level. Chalpuk does very well in that serve receive position. Uh, he's not done so well with the swing. USA will take the point. What he has done very well is hold that corner and stop the USA from getting any aces in that spot. But he can't stop them from making a block. Smith shutting him down. focus. It's a bit like a golfer before a swing, getting into the zone. That's what he's doing there with his pre-serve routine. A touch! Oh, that's an even better touch! The crowd go crazy. Free ball for Poland, though. Still trouble for the US, and they get the serve. What an amazing up by Shoji. Touch. Linked in the whole time with Shoji. Made a brilliant pickup. It was always the USA who were on the back foot, Poland in control of the rally. Poland have gone a little bit quiet. 
a stranglehold in this match at the moment. That's a really good swing from Russell, one on one. guys are too good. It takes something magical from the blocking side to try and stop them. Did well. He took that tip opportunity but played it very deep. quite ready for it. through him as that one hits the floor and he celebrates it. A little bit tight for Anderson. Oh my goodness me. You never trained for that. But that's for Holt to do anything about it. He's landed right in the corner. Brilliant serve, a lucky serve for Poland. Timeout, USA with a slender lead.
Johnson this time. Make sure he goes high hands to get the block out. Especially if it's good. It's your very high hands. Cycling. And again. But doesn't get it again. Correct will. He can't get it far enough off the block. And there's a chance now. Anderson. Didn't get it off the block. That one went through the block. Thank you. 
29% success rate in the first, but 100% with seven from seven in the second set. As you were saying, stepped up their game. That was just too low. Jushka couldn't do much with that. USA really are putting them head into the metal here. serve into transition two in the front row Sander in the back row taking that one to Spike Town Hype attacking at its best Schumann getting the crowd engaged and why not? Tie back called by Poland. Touch. Very nice swing by Kurek. That was a really clever play from him. Didn't just lash at it like some big thug. Played a very smart shot. Double substitution by Poland, Romanch is on. And Schliefka's come in, along with uh, Konarski. So a whole host of subs going on for Poland. Good up. Good work by Schliefka, the lefty. Getting that one away, cross court. It's well watched. Set to in the first place, set up this opportunity. block touch, cross weapons have got it off, and Konarski is not going to argue. We go to the second technical timer. So, USA, you have a good lead. See, that's one maybe they should be challenging to see whether Russell touched it last. A massive serving run for the USA, putting them in the position they're in. And they're just saying that Konarski has come on the court, number three for Poland. They want to make him, if he has a shot, to hit an extreme angle. They don't want to let him hit what he wants to hit. The block's got some work to do. Almost made the dig. Nice 
nice work by Anderson. Watching how this match is developing, both teams are happy to give up backcourt options just to make sure the ball is in for the setter to have at least two stroke three options from the players around them. Such as the serving pressure. And that's a very nice point from Poland. Well, that been out of stop, Konarski. Kohanowski now with the serve. Shoji on to it. Russell couldn't have a full swing. Really good pick up by Schlivka. Konarski this time has made a mistake, it's not caught the block, it certainly wasn't in. USA get off the rotation. Keep a healthy lead. Well, we're going to have a challenge. Just got that in in time. Let's see where we call the block, perhaps. Watching, active, game ready. Oh, that was a touch. It is touch. Challenge from Poland, they'll have the point then. 14-17 the score, not 15-18. Kokonowski. We only get 25 frames a second, then, depending on who's filming it. It might be 50 for uh, NTSC. Hawkeye cameras have 200 frames a second, so... Whoops. We will see what's going on. And we'll see an ace for Poland! Koganowski with a belter. And he gets to stay on court as well. USA forced to call a timeout. Oh, that was unlucky. That almost landed on Kohanovsky as he went running behind Schnitka. Very good swing by Anderson. He's nowhere near him in the end. This is just the angle I was sat watching from. Chris 
Christensen. A rare attack through the middle for Poland. Taken by Novakovsky. Working that one very nicely. I won't match working very nicely to Novakovsky. Double substitution reversed. Zrishka back in. Kurek back in to the front row. Poland have one substitution left in this set. They have one challenge left in this set. They've used all their time acts up. Kurek makes the block. Turns around and faces the bench. They're trying to run onto court. They've got into a bit of block, bit into trouble with the second round. That's a great block. Just go once again. Ireland now just one point behind in this pivotal set. couldn't deal with it. You also have their side out. Once again, you yes, say have an answer, though. Schnitzka. Oh, again, he's so good at fighting that angle. Makes you wonder whether or not the USA are just going to say, do you know what, he's hit so many in that spot, we're just going to stand there and make him hit somewhere else. Yeah. 
Time has not had a lot to do towards the end of this set. Yes, I think that block is in, so they are going to challenge the decision. Got it wrong. It's all square. Slivka. That's a good serve. But a great side out by Sander. Knows that he's got the block, tries to get it off the hands and away, and he's done exactly that. Smith. Good serve from him. There'll be no middle coming, it's high and wide, three blockers for Kubiak to deal with. And he can't deal with it. And the USA now has set point. Save set point. Koronowski with the serve. This young man is fearless. He's going with the jumper. And it's a very good serve. It's overpassed. But it's an error from Kurek, or is it? They've got no challenges, they can't. Or have they? Oh, they've got one. They have a challenge, they can. They can challenge this one. Oh, goodness me. Did Kurek get it in? What are they challenging? Block touch? Got to be clear. Must have to challenge block touch. Or oh, they're challenging net touch. Are they clutching at straws? Have the USA got the set, or are we 24 all? Challenge. We don't get told here in the arena what the challenge is. It doesn't come up on the big screens anywhere. Well, it's ball in, ball out. It is ball out, and it is the set for the USA. 25-23. They lead 2-1 in this semi-final. Yeah. 
and serves, no difference in that department. USA out of attack, Poland. And, but Poland made less errors. Bogdanowski keeps his place on court for Poland, so too does Sliwka. McDonald keeps his place on court for the USA. Holt to the bench. What a position for the USA, leading 2-1 at the moment. Here we go, USA leads 2. Sets goal on this game for the World Championship Seven. Kurek gets dug. So too does Sander. Well watched by McDonald. Oh, what a swing from Taylor Sander. Gave that everything. So too did Kubiak. Such a physical battle between these two teams. That's a nice dig by Christensen, he was just waiting for that, as calm as you like. Russell plays it, as it was going to land in. And it's landed in now, but it's landed in on Poland's side of the court. USA up 2-1. speed of that ball coming out by Kubiak. Going in between the hands of Russell. Oh, 
Super serve receive. Did a super block. Good Poland. Slivka was almost off doing a lap of honour. happened despite that last set who had the lead that's just a complete miss hit by Russell that's a good swing Anderson passing and hitting Sander with a belter. And USA level things up. Poland then, not happy with the decision. Taylor Sander, and they have touched the three metre line and he took off to attack. Oh, yes, he did. We're happy now. by Sander. Smith was up early, it all got a little bit congested. Russell, brilliant. Calm, waited, played the ball deep into the corner. There's nothing Poland could do. It's a nice pick up that by Kubiak. But that was on the side of the USA. It was a team to Russell to play it. This is a this is a big rotation now for the USA. If they get off this one, it'll be very important. Russell, not with the best of passes. Sanders got work to do. And that recycle. Oh yes! That was so crisp and clean and quick. That caught everyone by surprise. Wonderful second touch from Christensen. That's how it's done. Smith. Poland lead by two. USA lead by two sets to one. Alright, hey, that's actually not a bad score considering that little battle in the middle of the way to scrap off and side out. Let's wrap it up, okay? Alright, hey, we're gonna have to find other ways to side out and score points on this team right now. 
Okay? Keep thinking about that. I want to commit you a little bit. Okay? Okay? Think about where it's get on your Okay? Hey, hey, listen. Listen. 14 can pass, but he's a blocking liability. Okay? You can beat Batty. And uh, they don't set him as much, so we can help out a little bit. Okay? All right. Good? All right. Here we go. with the serve. Nice pick up by Zatorski. Kurek again. That same spot keeps beating Anderson to his right. Great swing. Just wasted by the USA. Just saw that little sidestep from Anderson. Having a word with him, said, Get that cross a little bit more, please. That's an error from Sander. He went with McDonald in the middle. The ball went out wide. Sandra made the most of it against Rushka. Good work by Sander. It's a similar story on both sides of the net at the moment. Tough serving, high ball out wide, and then it's a battle for the outside hitters to try and get past these big blocks. Poland unable to do it that time. Pressure being put by Christensen. <laughs> Russell gets a piece of the block. Our first challenge to see who touched that ball last now. And it might well be Kubiak. In. Maybe it looks like he did. So we're going to look at that block touch. It's a 
relatively new challenge scenario as to who touched the ball last. And generally, it's the attacker. I think it's something that more coaches are going to start to use more as they understand what's available. Shoji. Oh yes, nice pick up by Zhushka, but that's gone too wide. Be coming back. Two in it. Cover by Shoji. Again. If he can end up in plus six, plus seven on the stats, I would could well take this set. They're certainly going the right way about it at the moment, leading as they do by three. Very well passed. Good up by Shoji. Good covering by Christensen. Russell again. And he's put enough on that one to get it out over the other side of court. Big point for the USA. Get it from their serving. Russell with some hustle. The USA are back to within a point.
don't think they did touch the net. must have genuinely not felt that, otherwise it's a foolish thing to do to think that no one would have seen it. Oh, the third challenge. Russell with the serve. by Smith. These are side act points at the moment. Poland won't be overly bothered by them. Poland then leading by two still. Kubiak wild. Kubiak's trying to get high. He's up sex has gone right for his arms. So many of those have been happening. Yes, I haven't had an ace in a while. Somebody's due one soon, surely. by Konarski, Poland with their double substitution well match in the back row, Konarski gets a swing, gets it through past Sander without touching the antenna good serve by Kornarski Incredible how hard these guys can batter that ball off of the block consistently. That's just why you wonder why the teams aren't playing their sixes a lot deeper. Good dig. Touch, unfortunately, the goal smashing into Anderson, and that's the trouble again. At this level, you've got middle blockers who are racing to get out wide, travelling laterally to get their hands across, and so they're doing it. Goal just taking Anderson out.
Good work by McDonald. So he's still looking for a point from service. That's a really good ball in by Satorski. And a ridiculously good run by Kubiak. Kubiak not the highest. Look around, but good to see he takes the ball. At its highest point, he can reach it. Anderson went a little too early for that on a high ball. And now Poland have a chance to get to 20 points. And they've done it. Kurek gets block out. Poland lead by three. Excellent play that by Kurek. Oh, all right. Hey, they're making some switches. We'll take a look. Okay. Side out here, then reel right back. I'll put pressure on this team. Okay. All right. Hey, 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 there you go. Hey, 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 Torski's on to it. Oh, no, it didn't make it. That looked like it was in, in the corner. It looked like it was in, in the corner, but it may well have been wide of the short line. On the long line side, side if that makes sense. Or it may just have been absolutely perfect. It's absolutely perfect for Poland. What a swing that is by Kurek. 21-17, they now lead. The fifth set is looking more and more likely. into a point for the USA. Right at Zatorski, high from him, wide from Zuzka. Off the block from Kurek. Poland edging closer to the set. Nobody went with Smith. That's where the USA have an advantage. For as good as Koganovsky is, he's still young, he's still new to this and this environment. And he wasn't ready for that one. It's a good mismatch. The USA will try to exploit more. Oh, 
Oh, just when they make a dig, Sander touches the net. They've been having a real job to try and contain Kurek. Just when they get it into transition, it's a net touch against the USA. Easy one for Russell. Sander had to check back, and he couldn't get a full swing on it. Kovanovski makes the block. It's set point Poland. Excellent block from the youngster. Wanted to get that one done in style. Smith for the USA. Correct, puts it away. Poland take the set, 25-20. Two all, we're going into a decider. is at all in that set for either team and only three blocks incredibly Poland's error rate has dropped dramatically just three points they gave the USA USA gave Poland nine and that's been the issue USA probably the stronger team but they are making too many mistakes Fighting fifth set about to get underway. The race to 15 points to see who will be going to the gold medal match and who will be going to the bronze medal match. For Poland, they were in the gold medal match in 2014 and won it. They're looking to get there again. The 
USA haven't been to a gold medal match since 1986. Something's got to give and something will give. Anderson with the serve for the USA. USA didn't use the pipe attack very much in the last set. Although Christensen was getting the middle going. Perhaps he was making way for some pipe attack to come here in this decider. In part though, that pipe wasn't able to come because of the serving strength of Poland. And that's two errors in a row now for the USA. Lots of broken plays, lots of out-of-system plays. Again. A tough serve. And that's where the teams have just dealt with it. That ball up near the ceiling, just popped out wide. Nothing special. There's three blockers. What can I do with the ball? This is what I can do with the ball. Work the block. Get the point. Send the guys up, calm down, but there's nothing is won yet. He's just waiting for it, waiting for the ball to go out there, lining up Sander, getting his hands across the net. Bench really enjoying that one. This is going to be the red and white. We're going to be going to gold medal match, and will it be the red, white, and blue of the USA? Right now, Poland are in the driving seat. Drushka with the serve. And Kurek demolishes another ball on the right-hand side of court. This is incredible for Poland. What a block that is! The USA wanted to try and run the pipe. Novakovsky was ready for it. It's not often you get a one-on-one -on -one block on the pipe. scoreline we're seeing at the moment. Poland 6, USA 1. A point from service, then three points from service. And then another one after 
serving from seven. They need to take a moment. They've had the timeout. Get back into this one. ASAP. It's a lovely little ace serve as he tickles that one over the net. Kutowski tried to get it. There's no way near it. This time, Kubiak. Gets the ball down and no one can get near him. But just not in right position to play defense, USA, on that right hand side. Anderson's in quite a way. He has been throughout the game and he keeps getting beaten to his right by Kubiak and Kurek. Getting better and better for Poland here. Slivka makes the block. Just gave it everything, got across the net, put the ball down. Teams are now going to change ends. Poland leading 8-3. Back into the action for the USA. Kubiak. It's been given as in, is an ace serve for Kubiak. The lines judge said it was out. The referees overruled him. It's a brilliant serve from the captain of Poland. Good art by Kubiak. Another chance maybe. Kurek again. Oh, he shut down this time. It was getting more and more difficult. The angle was running away. That was Kubiak who went behind. I thought that Zuzka could make the set. It was a little change in positions. Nice block though from Sander. Brilliant again. Nothing seems to be able to stop Poland right now. Certainly not the serving of the USA or their blocking. Novakovsky past Holt. They're believing. Free swing for Holt. Step up, it's got to be now or never, otherwise, it will be never. Oh dear, that's heartbreak for the USA. Poland are four points away from going to the final. Double substitution, one match in, Konarski in. Given his serving instruction by Heinen. 
Going after the front court swing of Russell. Here's a pick up. What a match! Brilliant! Gets it in play. Kokonowski gets it over. And Satorski almost made the dig of the tournament. But it is a point for the USA. back to serve. Satorski puts it in, Womack out wide, Konarski. Recycled by Poland, Konarski again, oh it's a massive block by Anderson! Phenomenal block by Matthew Anderson to shut down Konarski. to finish. McDonald goes back to serve. Poland are in a brilliant position here in this fifth set. For the USA are making inroads into the deficit. It was a good serve again. Overpassed. 11-9. Another point for the USA. McDonald with nerves of steel from the serving line. And Russell with a brilliant block out. at the moment. Kotorski puts an excellent ball in. And Kurek gets it through the block. They'll be breathing a little easier now, Poland. What a serve from Slivka, the overpass put away by Kubiak and straight away the team go to Slivka to say well done, what a brilliant serve. Nothing at all USA could do. Slivka once again. for a carry, it's not been given, USA have to go again. And they do, Russell hammers it down. They've made it to 10, they're three behind. But Poland only need two points. Can't 
turn games around. Satorski with a really good pass. Kubiak gets block out. It's a match point for Poland. That's some hit from Kubiak. Goganowski to serve. The ball is in. It's not over just yet. That was a hard in the mouth moment watching that swing. Match point saved. Now Russell has to do it from the serving line. Three chances for Poland inside out. Kubiak puts it down. Poland are going to the final. An amazing performance and Kurek on the floor, no doubt there'll be emotions from him. He has led this team to victory in this match against the USA. The USA were favourites coming into this one. Nobody told Poland that. And the team who won the gold medal in 2014 in Poland are going to try and win it back again here in Italy in 2018. What an incredible game. Heartbreak for the USA. They'll have a chance to get on the podium. And they'll play for bronze. But by far and away, Kurek the MVP for Poland. The player who wasn't in the team for the World Championships on home soil. A single-handedly delivered an amazing performance to help his team make it to the final here in Italy. And don't take away the performances of Slivka and Kochanowski, two junior world champions. Just an amazing team performance and Heinan will be rightly proud of that.